come with us now, if you dare, down a rickety staircase into a dank, dark basement. What awaits the Saturday Night Freak Show? <laughs> Thanks for listening to the Saturday Night Freak Show Goodbye. podcast. <laughs> Every Saturday night we do this, we watch a movie that's chosen round robin by one of the group, and then we sit around the bar, drink libations, and talk about it for your listening pleasure and enjoyment. It always sounds like Colin's just getting a little more tired of it as we go along. Like, every yeah, maybe, Saturday maybe night we do this bullshit. Like, Welcome again, back to the again. Saturday night. Thanks, you should be excited. All the time. Oh, we're back. For six years I've been doing this. It's Saturday again. <laughs> All right, next week it's going to be full of Christmas cheer. Yeah. All right, so these are your internet radio superstars. Holly. Sean. Travis. And I'm the aforementioned Colin and tonight we watched a movie that was chosen by Sean. Sean Me. is responsible. What yep, we watch? My fault. 1997's Jack Frost. You know who made this movie? Michael Cooney. This is not the other Jack Frost. This we is should not say. Michael Keaton's Jack Frost. When of course did that not. Come out? That came okay. out after, yeah, like, which is like really confusing, right? Yeah. yeah. Like, why would they? Disney's like, shut up. We're what's, doing. What's the plot line of the Michael? It's like a he dies, dies, he dies, and I think his son snack. wishes him back, and yeah. he turns into a snowman. Come on, guys, we just Kid. watched a bad no. movie. We're going to talk about a fucking worse movie. It's like, heartbreaking. <laughs> they have to say goodbye to him at the end again. It's really sad. <laughs> every Michael, Michael Keaton. He every movie Michael bit. Keaton does, he dies. Like seriously, I'm sick of him dying in movies. He didn't die in Spotlight. Whatever. Or in <laughs> Batman. Or um, Batman. Yeah, so, or the true. Dream Team. So this movie is about a <laughs> serial <laughs> killer who dies and comes back as a snowman. snowman. As Thanks a to snowman. the genetic testing truck that spilled chemicals all over the road. Yeah, before we get into the <laughs> fucking... Because st- it's like there's no plot to this movie. Before we even get into it. like it's okay, thin. Does everybody remember around the time this came out? Yes. I remember it vividly because this was the end of horror movies. This was it. Freddy Krueger. But Travis declares the end of horror movies in every most, decade. It, it was yeah, all over. This was it. This no, was I've always, no, I've always said Freddy Krueger killed the horror movie because after the whole, like, you know, no screaming while the bus is in motion, you know, that shit killed horror movies because everybody's like, that's what you got to do. If you're going to sell the Freddy toy, you got to have the funny guy. You got to have the fucking parents laughing so they'll take the kids and they'll be laughing. We'll have the NES games. We'll have the... And this fucking ruined horror movies to where well, everything was the eighties horror movie. Yeah. For sure. well, well, but it, did it but kill then it, we went it into changed the 90- it, right? Oh. Yeah. Oh. Well, the nineties was like notoriously <laughs> a well, it tried to go dire for, decade well, for horror tr- movies. Everybody tried to go for that fucking new Freddy Krueger. You had Doctor Giggles. You had Rumpelstiltskin. You had ah, fucking Rumpelstiltskin. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I want to watch that Dude, one again. Do you remember Sandman? That's a great movie. Do you remember the Sandman or the Sleepwalker? It was called Sleepwalker. Dude, it's like the fucking same story as this about a fucking criminal getting, like, hit by... It's just like, how many fucking movies are going to make about a serial killer that gets hit with some genetic shit? I want to mark it. Three minutes in, Travis is yelling already. I just want to mark that down. Well, because no, this might I, be a record. This was so... I mean, this, you guys got to understand. I was exploring horror movies at this time, right? And I was... So I was finding all this fantastic shit, right? So then anything that was actually coming out in my lifetime, like, if I'd pick up a Fangoria, it'd be like, what the fuck? Who wants to see this shit? Like, so I was like, you know, it was, sure this was, had a cover. It was, it was painful. It was painful to know that, like, oh, my God, the past, like, 30 years have yeah. been, like, just they were awesome. For the horror movies were awesome. have been amazing. And then everything I see coming out is like, fucking what? Yeah. <laughs> like, it's a joke. Horror movies are a joke. Yeah, oh. until what? Yeah. It was basically Scream came along and and yeah. saved the genre. Again. Kinda, yeah. 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 Oh, my, the, it. yeah. yeah. A little revitalization the in there. Who done it? And whatever came back. Yeah. The uh, the I was thinking that the beginning of this was like taking. I mean, I guess anytime you have like uh, there's somebody who gets a chemical. It was Swamp Thing, right? They like took the the opening of Swamp Thing or something. You got a guy who gets doused in chemicals. Who this time. Uh, falls into snow instead of a swamp, and yes. then he is reborn as a snowman instead of a swamp man. Oh man, this is gonna hurt. <laughs> oh, oh, oh one liners. Well, we should say that yeah. this movie. Uh, do we know who made this movie? I mean, um, Michael Cooney wrote and directed. I'm assuming humans. I know, like <laughs> some version. Did he of do animal. like anything else? Jack Frost two. He wrote perhaps? Jack Frost two. He wrote Identity. 
And then everything like the else. one with John Cusack? Yeah. Really? He did. Down. He wrote uh, Identity, I which is a good movie. I don't like it, but I guess that's something to be... A lot of people like it. Yeah. So I guess that's something to be said for It's his, something, but not much else. It got him... Th- I, I mean, I guess this got him that. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, yeah Avengers was like first. six years later. 2003 was Identity. Oh, okay. So now so. he just takes his TBS like, royalty money for like identity <laughs> yep. showings once a year. And just like, <laughs> now who's laughing? Yeah, I think he wrote a few things, maybe produced something or other, but nothing really major after Identity. Wow. Well, it's just amusing when you're watching this movie like early on, the amount of effort that the production crew must have gone into <laughs> to try and convince, you know, to, to make it look like there was actually snow Winter. on the ground. And well, there is uh, it is winter places. in some shots. Yeah. There is legitimate snow, and you can see the character's breath. Right. But in a lot of the early scenes, I mean, it's like it's bad. <laughs> it is. They have like fuzzy they have a, snow. Yeah. What? Cotton, they're, they're, in cotton cotton in the movie, trees. they're making these yeah. uh, snowmen in the town square, and they are basically they look like they are made of like down feathers. Or something. Let's just yeah. say they use everything in this movie for snow. They use fucking what I'm, looks like shaving cream. I'm pretty sure or, they just went to Joanne Fabrics and. Like, like, what do you got that's white? What's white? Yeah. What can we <laughs> do that's on there. white? We got they some... literally do that, though, at one point. That shit that you put down, my mom does it every year with her little yeah. Charles Dickens. Uh, yeah. The little houses know. and stuff. Yeah. yeah. There's this snow that you put down. It's like yeah. a felt. It's kind. angel they hair. They have this. Be careful. Like, in one of the shots, because I was looking at it, the camera dips a little too low <laughs> in the frame, and you yeah. can see that, There's you know, sheets like. sheets of this shit, yeah. Yeah. There's so little snow, they decorate the outsides of buildings with that fake Drippy snow yeah. stuff, the just that goes like on the, the edging felt. and everything. Yeah. Yes, they went yeah, up and shot just like the seventies, right? <laughs> like, they go like, and they put like cotton in balls. Cotton, like, yep. Yeah. <laughs> they spread it out like it's the fucking like like I'm sure they had to buy the the Halloween spider. I was the Halloween spider webs. Like, it's exactly whatever. what it was. Yeah, it's fucking white. So it's yep. we're saying that it's cheap. We actually think oh, they went they cheap. went and shot in Big Bear, which is up in California, which but there is where snow the guy's Big Bear. mom lived. Probably that's mom. what we're guessing. <laughs> or, or we're guessing the cousin, that grandma. Can use I use your house? The house, the house, ladies and gentlemen, the house in this yeah. movie. Because you only see the sheriff's, you only see his kitchen and his back door. And then uh, we A didn't mention room. this was Shannon, Shannon Elizabeth's first, first movie. movie. Her family gets to live in the living room of this house. Yeah. I guess they thought the living room was more important. Well, because I guess the kid is always cooking up dumb shit. They have an autistic kid who... <laughs> oh, it's got to be. He has, he to, has be. to be. Because they're just like, it's real good, son. Real, you done real good. Oh, good the boy. way you killed that squirrel. Real good, boy. Yeah. I don't get it. It's almost like, okay, because we're supposed to get the sheriff uh, is the guy that caught Jack Frost. Yes. No, it would make sense if the, the That's kid, his actual name, Jack Frost. Jack Frost, yeah. really, people? Like well, it's a fucking bad... Well, they come from Snowminton, Colorado. Yeah, Snowminton. Snowminton. But, like, even Stan Lee was coming up with better fucking names for, like, you know, Otto Octavius. It just wasn't, like, the Octopus Man. Like, like my name's yeah. Henry... Who's Jack Octopus. Frost in uh, actual... Like, he's a little elf or something? A Jack fairy? Frost? Yeah, what is he? I'm a oh, imp? I don't yeah. fucking know. Oh, like the Rankin, Rankin base, like yeah, well, like mythology yeah. or whatever. Mythology and whatnot. Yeah, I think yeah, he yeah, is like sure. more from Rankin. He Bass. is the I Frost, think. I guess. He's responsible yeah. for the Frost. Doesn't like the what? Who Burl Ives sings about him? I don't I think know. Probably I don't know. right. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so this is not your daddy's Jack Frost. Is what oh we're no, saying. not at all. Well, not actually, even from the beginning, where there's like a weird cartoon character, like Daddy, will you tell me a story? It opens with a Christmas story. But this, which might actually be the best part of the movie. Yeah, yeah, this is subjective, <laughs> but it's, there's a, a credit sequence <laughs> where the camera's just prowling over a Christmas tree right. that's decorated with like, it's like a credits. film by so the, and so. Yeah, it's the, the credits. credits the, the, the idea is they're sound. In the, ornaments, yeah. the execution is long. <laughs> because yeah. this movie doesn't want to cut. This movie did everything it could not to edit, so it's just like whatever, guys. The longest well, shot you can do. The, there's no money for the setups. They're just no. doing master shots. We're like, put all of your cast, yeah, in yep. frame. yeah. handheld because we can't lock it down. We just got to oh, go, man. go, go, or we just can't put it, pick up a fucking tripod in Grandma's goddamn kitchen. Like, yeah. That's what I'm yeah. thinking. It's like. But I gotta get over by the kitchen or by the refrigerator. <laughs> I can't get a tripod here. So the Whatever spirit of the filmmakers making this movie, we're saying, is we applaud that sure. execution yeah. and concept. You How know. many Killer Snowman movies have you seen? Yeah, because well, in the end of credits, why? it says something to the effect that like all credit cards were courtesy of the director yeah. or whatever. Yeah. So this yeah. is clearly like you know, and they have those scenes where the town uh, assembles. 
And it's like 12 people. <laughs> they're not extras, though. They're like just people who were available that yes. day and who wanted to come be in a movie. So oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So this is getting, this is getting, you know, putting on a show. Yep. Getting the community together. Hey, we're making to a movie. movie. Yeah. 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 You love it. So this probably played big in like Big Bear, no. uh, California. Sure. You think? Yeah, because they wouldn't say we're well, done. I mean, come on, there's a film festival uh, up there at some point. I remember when this came out. I mean, it was people love fucking the irony of shit films. They just love it. They're just like, this is gonna suck. You know, your Sharknado fans. Yeah. You know, well, well, this was. It struck this me. Is what we have. It's God like kind it. of like this in is the same people. In the same vein as like something like Wolf Cop, right? Yeah, yeah exactly. Where it's like, it's a horror comedy where the comedy is like really broad, like almost like really you were saying broad. airplane level. Not even comedy. no, like no. Zucker that's, Brothers. That's why I was like, this is why this movie doesn't work because this tries to be a fucking movie. And it's like, are you crazy? This needed to be an airplane. The problem is, is five percent of this script is airplane. So when they do do these jokes. Like the like oh. the get your foot off of the uh, oh yeah yeah the, the rock there's chair. like a dead dude in a rocking chair <laughs> and the camera's like uh, you know uh, you can't see it yeah it's facing the back and whatever and he's rocking back and forth and the sheriff tells the deputy to get his foot, foot off foot. then it stops like, rocking but you can't only <laughs> have the movie. four of those type of jokes in a movie you either go for that comedy or you don't <laughs> right and this movie tried to be a fucking movie. <laughs> it really tried. It tried, dude. Tried so it tried hard. to have this thing about, like I said, the sheriff uh, put Jack Frost away. Uh, it's got your, it's got your, your typical, your, your badass FBI agent who comes in all in black, turtleneck, just yeah. like I'm here to save this town. Get out of my way. Yeah, he's come with a representative from the chemical company. The I chemical. thought it was weird at the beginning that they were going to try and have like the sheriff. Who's going to be, you know, obviously the guy who put Jack Frost away. Oh. And so he's going to be your lead character. Oh. And then there was like another sheriffy type character introduced as the FBI agent. It was just like, yeah. how are you going to pull this off? You know, is there room in this narrative for two characters to <laughs> basically fill the exact same role? Because yeah. the well, FBI guy, guy comes with the the explanation, you know, yeah. uh, exposition guy, right? Mm. I come from the chemical company and we were trying what. They were trying well, to make. He was jurisdiction a, guy. Well, yeah, but like I, you don't have jury. You know that's all you need in a like. I got a cop. I need someone to be there. And be like, it's my town. Jurisdiction. I know more than you. Do you? Do well, you of course think? you Why don't. Just, yeah. I don't know. I you could have had a, a snowman killing people, but you got no fucking money. <laughs> you got no suit. So it's like you got to make the movie about something. <laughs> Yeah, they really yeah. didn't have a suit. I mean, it's basically no. like second roll of snowman up and then large mittens. Yeah, it was there were <laughs> mittens were the hands on this thing. Yes. And yeah. even like they even had the like, I mean, I thought it was not a bad idea that he can like produce icicle things. I'm like, sure. oh, cool. Like, I mean, just to, I don't know, character design, like. What if he just had icicle fingers to make it look scary and threatening or something? Instead of just being a... F I've never seen a snowman with arms. All right. Never in my <laughs> life. You don't make a snowman with arms. No, they have stick arms. Right, yeah. Uh, yeah, I guess you're... Yeah. I guess. But this well, one had, like, stick... Uh, had arms. Well, he did. but you put a, hat, a magic hat on him, then he had <laughs> arms. He didn't yeah. just... So I don't the, think the, the magic, kids... The magic acid is different. I don't think the... the <laughs> Uh, yeah, okay. Well, <laughs> so All this, right. this is gonna be really weird. We gotta quit talking about the Michael. Well, Key I know, Jack but Fryer I wasn't killing. looking for. I was looking for the poster for this movie, oh. but there's the poster for the the Michael Keaton, which kind of scarier. A snowman, which is basically the exact it's same, the same design. Thing, yeah. as well, how not can you make a thing. snowman? No, that's not the same thing. That actually has character in the face. Like, I think it's pretty. They could even make Jack Frost's eyes look like coals. It's like these people don't know what coals are are shaped like. <laughs> Kid didn't know how to put together a snowman. Okay, oh, now that's right. I do now we're looking that. at the poster for it's, Jack like Frost. A skull. Oh, yeah. Very different. We're, this does not. It is not representative of the design no. of the snowman. That probably the was movie. the concept design, though. I wonder. Well, <laughs> I don't think so. Somebody afterwards said there's no way we can sell this with the uh, you know friendly looking Frosty the snowman yeah. looking thing. So we're gonna sell that. Sell it as a horror movie. Yeah. Well, but there was at least the one like head where he had icicle teeth. Yeah. Uh, there's some icicle teeth too. Is it? Let's see. Is it it is Hawaii. Jack Frost. And there's too. a little one inside. Revenge of the Mutant Killer Snowman. They go Hawaiian. Okay. They go Hawaiian. <laughs> <Just like> every, <laughs> he's yep. icing and slicing. It's like if you're crappy, you go 
to space or to Is hell. It ice but if you are complete <laughs> shit, you go Hawaii. Because in this one, it's he's chilling and killing. <laughs> uh, so they continued with that motif. Chilling. Oh, boy. Bravo, boy. bravo. Yeah. I want to know who came up with it. I know I saw Steve uh, Screaming Mad George's name in the credits. We mentioned yeah. him before on a show called we did about the Giver. Giver. Because we were saying that his work in that is not, like, horrible, right? I mean, he was one of the 80s. I mean, he worked on the Elm Street movies and, you know, yeah. subsequent yeah. Predator. You do the original Predator, Predator design, right? The original yes, one, the one that yes. got, yeah, the uh, one that got axed. I think so, yeah, right? The one that got axed, yeah. Yeah. Maybe. But he's so. involved somehow in this movie, but I... Because he brought it over to Guyver, kind of. Mm-hmm. That one monster. But I refuse to believe that that man had anything to do with the design that I saw tonight <laughs> and this snowman. I mean, it looks he like... He designed this, like, this is what I want to do, and the poster you saw. Well, what like, was no. the most, like, special effects thing you saw? In this the movie? snowman? No, I don't know. Was it the woman like growing teeth? I don't know, maybe when he was melting in the beginning. Like, when he was turning oh, into shit. the snowman. Oh, yeah. yeah. yeah That's probably. some good effects. Yeah, he gets the goo on him, and then there's a series of uh, what it cuts, I guess. It cuts back to the guy And the, Yeah, reacting. the only thing we can cut to is the guy reacting, huh? And then cuts and back to, like, like oh, he's a little more smiling. melted. Now he's a puppet. Oh. Now he's a skeleton yeah. puppet. And then he's <laughs> in the goo. And right the away, snow. you're like, you got a guy that is reminiscent of the killer Santa Claus from Silent Night, Deadly Night 2. Like, that is who this yeah. actor reminds me of. The guy that plays Jack Very Frost. over the top. over the top. Like, Tad. Yeah. Oh, Tad. Oh, Tad. <laughs> this was his only shot. It was, was like he was playing the it. mask. Like, if Jim Carrey <laughs> wouldn't have been the mask, he would have been like, oh, yeah, you know. Oh, Jesus Christ, this guy. He yelled a lot. Over the top. He'll find well, a way. He was, was, he, he was like Michael Shannon in fucking Superman. Well, like, I will fight him. Oh. I will fight him. <laughs> That's it, was. wasn't, it wasn't until they did the, the backflash of the sheriff arresting him that me and Holly were like, oh, shit, he's shining yeah. Jack. He is Jack Nicholson. Yeah. He was and in he the red Even, even to, the red yeah. jacket. Yeah. yeah. Even he was, the, oh, yeah. dude, his hair, everything was like, okay, yeah. what is it? 30 years ago, he got arrested by the sheriff? What the fuck? Why does he look like? Because he's in a business suit or some shit in the back of this fucking paddy wagon. Right. Mm. Slick back hair. Clean Slick back hair. And, like, supposedly they just caught him, right? Because that's the idea. Or, I guess They're it could have been a few him. months, right? But, yeah, they've had him in jail. He's going he's, to get executed. He's going because to get We executed. know this because on the side of the van it says... Uh, <laughs> execution van or whatever. Yeah, execution <laughs> transport yeah. vehicle Fuck or whatever. retarded. <laughs> <laughs> retarded. So you just label that shit. Yeah. Well, I mean, yeah. So How people else, know what's you going know, on. Well, so you know what van to load him in. Well, yeah. what <laughs> prison doesn't have their fucking, uh, like, electric chair in the prison? I mean, why does he have to go anywhere for it? Was he in a county? I don't know. Whatever. Probably. Yeah. Something. And then, they, and then he collided with the the research van, which was labeled. genetic research. <laughs> genetic, <laughs> research. <laughs> genetic research. Well, well I mean, chemicals inside. So clearly, it's like these the filmmakers know that there's a certain tone that they're going for with this, right? Which is, you know, we're, we're naming our killer Jack Frost. It's going to be a movie about a killer snowman. Mm-hmm. We're not going to take this seriously at all. But it it does have this kind of weird thing where, like, it does. Want you to take certain parts of it anytime it goes to the sheriff. Well, he's like a the the guy who plays it. Well, I would say like most of the actors in this are like competent actors, right? Doing what you're asked to do, yeah, what they're asked to do, you know, an actor in a movie. And it's like, so either their performances are kind of running against the grain of what the tone of the movie is because they don't know they're in a comedy. You don't think so? I think they well, all no, I mean, act like, like they, they know they're the, in a comedy, really? you know? It felt oh, like yeah. the characters Dude, look didn't at the, know they were in a... Or at least the, the sheriff. The other anyway. cops. There's, the, the, yeah. there's a reception, a cop receptionist that knows she's like in Roseanne or whatever because everything she <laughs> yeah. says, she ends up like giving it a little like... It's just like, god damn that lady. Yeah, and the goofy... Always the goofy, uh, oh, goofy cops, cops yeah, right? Yeah, the other deputies. deputies, yeah. Well, because, yeah, you Fucking Pez. We shouldn't leave her up the 12 days of Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> I was the only one that chuckled uh, at that one. And then they even tried with, uh, like, they're timing a serious conversation worthy. about the guy with the axe in his throat and the two idiots just moving the Christmas tree in the background. Yeah. Like, yeah, I would have mentioned that, the coroner, because, you know, like I said. You know, coroner is the best. He's like, you got, like, three I locations. Think. You don't want to be like, what are we going to do with the coroner's office? Oh, fuck it. The coroner, like, just looks at bodies out in the crime scene, I guess. Yeah. Well, why not? 
<laughs> just check them out. It's like We've only we got move five it. bucks in three hours. Let's and we bring can't blow up here. a building, so we're not going to do that. Yeah. Well, but we're still going to put it in the script. <laughs> yes. Well, this is a, <laughs> a, note, like, a note to filmmakers. I want to be filmmakers everywhere. If you can't afford it, right? Why do it? Don't do it. Well, they couldn't even do the car accident, right? Because the car accident's like, ah. we're going to crash. And then you just do the spinning camera. <laughs> it even did a camera. slow and then, The bumper's coming together. I didn't oh, even know it, what it, I was it, looking I at. I didn't even like, what are like, they doing? It was supposed ding. to be a slow, like, ding. Yeah. And then the explosion. And then and whatever ding. box they were in, they just rolled. They just <laughs> everybody in it. And then, and then you just see a tire spinning, and you're like, the camera's going to back up, and you're like, okay, so what? It's on its side or something? And they're like, nope. All we did was fucking uh, jack, jack it up. Jack up. it up a little bit and <laughs> spin, spin the, the wheel. And then the uh, camera just brilliant. backs. It's like, so what? It's, it's like shorthand for car accident. <laughs> Ridiculous. You know what's going on just by that. And then there's a very slow, like, as the security guard is realizing that Jack Frost, well, he sees Jack Frost get sprayed with this uh, uh, genetic research. <laughs> I guess. Right, with genetic if that's what it, if that's what's, what was said on the uh, must be what it's called, and doesn't want to say either. He's not getting paid to say anything. He has no lines or because he's just doing like. What? Like he's, I'm yeah. kind of nervous he's with like facial confused, expressions. But then like, he's like smiling. It's really weird. And there's no <laughs> like. Huh? 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 Like you think if you're making an oh, even an overtop comedy, you'd be like, uh, 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 or like right, scratch yeah. his head with a. Yeah. <laughs> right. No, he didn't know what he was doing. He wasn't directed. He was no. just like, well, give it to me this way, this way, this way, and this way, and I'll and sort we're it using out later. all of and them. And then you end up using it all because the special effects come back. Maybe we could have used like a blink, 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 blink. Yeah. Like a, <laughs> <laughs> boing. yeah. Oh god, the sound effects editing. The sound effects <laughs> editing. There's if a sound of a, a door that is so generic, and it's used every single time anyone opens a door anywhere <laughs> in this movie. Oh. Yeah. You just can't have yeah. a silent door. You just no. can't. No, it's gotta make some noise. Beep, 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 uh, I can't beep, even do it, but oh, it's terrible. It's like uh, a fucking Resident most of Evil this game. Terrible. Like, yeah. So yeah, the kid. The the reason the sheriff's house is the kitchen. The reason the sheriff lives in the kitchen with his family. <laughs> yep. <laughs> open the oven, slide out beds. Yep. The kid likes to cook crap. And it's a real big joke really about does. how, like, sure, bud, we'll eat it. Oh, fuck our kid. You know, <laughs> the parents are saying that to each other in their eyes. You know, they're like, yeah. Oh, he made another one. Yeah, yeah. Jesus. It's like, I don't know if they have parents that actually like their kid in a movie instead of like, real good job, bud. It was almost like Twilight Zone, right? Like, like they're going to, he's going to wish him out to the cornfield. They're like, you did it. It was a real good thing you did there. It's a real good thing. It's more like he can't go outside or he'll hurt himself. So we're gonna keep him in the kitchen. Yeah. <laughs> it's better he plays with the chocolate. The well, fudge. the kids were again. He doesn't know he... how to put a snowman together. Yeah, yeah, autistic, yeah. not retarded. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, the autistic. He's a ginger. Kid. We don't think he actually is autistic. Uh, but at the end, what he put in the uh, in the drink? Uh, you don't want it was, it was in the sludge. It was oatmeal. It was oatmeal, but oatmeal. he didn't want his dad to freeze, so, so he put uh, chemicals. So the kid's written to be younger than he's portrayed in the movie. Is that what's going on? I or are we saying he's touched, soft? He's got to be upstairs. He's uh, dumb I think that was a dolphin. joke. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it just, it doesn't, but it joke. doesn't play very well. But we get our no, first murder with the stupid. kid. Yeah, our first murders with the kid where <laughs> this group of guys is picking on him. There's a bully, of course, because he's just like, hey, little kid. Yeah. Fuck you. It's like a You're Christmas obviously story. stupid. It's like <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yeah, you got to have that in a Christmas, any Christmas story. I want to say it's Silent Night, Deadly Night. That's the first, like, yeah, the two kill, right? The There's always yeah. some, like, what are you doing, fat? You know, like, we're taking these, you know, sluts or whatever. <laughs> yeah. That's what you got to do. That's how you get, and they like, get come up and cred in the snow town or whatever. You got to. <laughs> yeah. Snowmanton. 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 Snow Jersey. So, so, okay, so what? The fucking stupid... Uh, I mean, the snowman pushes snow, him over, and the fucking pushes the, him. the sled is sharp enough to his just kid, cut his like, head his, clean off. One of his friends already. It's like I guess the idea is the kid's sled behind his behind the sheriff's house. Everything's about the sheriff's house. I'll tell you one location. It was that house because <laughs> yeah. these kids were going to sled behind the house. It's a black diamond sledding zone behind, right through his. Yeah, he yard. says yeah. something about black. I thought yeah. it was black. Not about black, black ice. ice sorry. Yeah. Black yeah. ice. Because I kept area. thinking he was saying black guys. 
It's a black guy. <laughs> it's really confused. Black guy sledding here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's like, wow. Oh, my God. You just, that's the twist. You find out that this town is not progressive. It's like, <laughs> I don't think there were like black people. <laughs> yeah. But there was like, uh, so everybody, like, there's the, the, the dead kid's dad is like, you know, your kid's evil or whatever. He's, touched, like, touched he, yeah, evil. he's the one who's he's killing touched. people in this town. Well, first of all, the fact that the, the that a uh, dead person, the old guy, who I don't think we ever meet prior to no. finding no, him dead. We just no. know that he's got an apple orchard. We don't even right. know why. <laughs> but the, the, like, there's a guy frozen yeah. and they, God the cops it. discover him <laughs> and then they're, they're freaked out. They're like, We've had a killing in this town, and you're looking at it going Shut like, everything down. I don't get it. There's a frozen body. How is right. this? The guy, like, there's no blood. Right. The guy right. could have sat no... out and just right. fallen That's what dead I thought. and frozen I think, I think you're yeah. supposed to get the idea that his head is like bent well, far well, back. Well, until the coroner shows up and explains this to you. Right. And Almost the, like he's wearing And the corpse looked like... Like decayed, yeah. Like, but it was, yeah. but it was supposed to be like the day before. <laughs> be like yeah. an old man, it's a desiccated. Like an old yeah. Well, like what this movie is missing is the sheriff's just like, I don't even know how they get to the fact that it's Jack Frost. I can't even remember. The FBI is there because they know that Jack Frost. Oh, that's somehow right. the the chemical guy because the the chemical company was trying to come up with a new serum that bonds human DNA with an inner object for reasons i'm not entirely for immortality not hello yes. that's what he fucking said and he's yeah. trying to see if they could do that if the soul would be transferred with it because that's his ultimate goal to see if the soul is chemical mm-hmm. according to his exposition late in the movie yeah <laughs> that's it thank yeah. you sean no problem <laughs> glad i can no, help. It, it all it makes is. sense yeah there it is. Well, but, so, <laughs> but this movie's trying to give you the idea that like i put him away he's coming after me Mm-hmm. But then, well, because but he sent him all those letters that letters. said, I'm, I'll, find, I'll find a way to get you. Oh. Then, he, yeah. then he signed. The classic uh, magazine, the, yeah, magazine yeah, the cut out. letters. Yeah. <laughs> just like, that was just like we know who it's from. Why aren't you just <laughs> writing this? It. Frost. Yes. But that's still just, just write it. No, but that's still he just shit. He did, but that's still just like shit he did in the prison, right? Like, I'm, I'm yeah. saying like. Where's the scenes of Jack Frost actually finding this guy, or, or he just knows where he is? That's where the movie just like I just know. I'm just gonna kill I mean, these other people on the well, way. Well, because yeah. he was, I, he was I gotta stop in that guy's guy's jurisdiction. I have to yeah. stop a sheriff he's, or a he stopped, deputy with a stop sign. He stopped in Snowmingtonville to pee, and that's where the uh, sheriff arrested him, so he knows where he is. Snowmington, <laughs> <laughs> Snowmington Colorado. Village, yeah, Snowmington, yeah. Snow- Snow- Colorado. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. So, but somehow the cops he ran over the he ran over the sheriff or the the deputy guy. Right. He gets yep. in his car because we find out he can melt. Yeah. Yep. That's one oh, yeah. of his superpowers. He kills the older couple whose son had died. Oh. He kills Shannon Elizabeth's entire family. Can we talk about the horrible acting of this couple? Their son died, and they have like no remorse. They're, they're very well. He's bad. pissed because he's. This is how. Once again, I'm like. So is this. Is this cheap filmmaking? Yes. Or well, or or, or. is it just we, cheap? Yes. Dumb. <laughs> because like okay, oh. as a Christmas <laughs> yes. movie, okay, it's like okay, whatever. You got fake snow. You got some Christmas trees. You got some lots of lights. You got of like not very well played decorated. You got your but buddy to be like bump 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 bum, for oh, like yeah. the whole movie. Yeah, so yeah like, on the music. But is it Christmassy? Is this as in movie, like, does it have Christmas spirit? It doesn't have as much as Krampus, at all. So let me tell you that. To me, at least. <laughs> because, okay, this the reason why I'm like, is this lazy or is this just like, you know, because Shannon Elizabeth is the sister of the, kid, the kid that dies, yeah. right? And she's like, well, I'm going to go out because you two are just grieving. And he's like, you're not going to be a whore and take Jesus. As-. I'm like. Okay, so this is like the anti-Jesus guy, right? This is, or no, he is the Jesus guy, yeah, right? Yeah, he, he but took, I'm saying, he took the Lord's name in vain. But I'm saying in the movie, he's your anti-Jesus guy. I guess that's what I meant. He's the anti-Jesus guy for the audience. He's the person you're supposed to be like, yeah, man. But like, there's Parents nothing religious understand. in the house at all. Like, at all. At all. There's not a cross yeah, in this movie. He's from a small town. They all go to church, I'm sure. Oh, yeah. There's a priest, a reverend. There is a one priest. Yeah, he helps out all the time. So it's, it's a close-knit priest, community. Yes. Well, you're, all your priests are Irish. Or I mean, whatever. They, I'm true. Of course, <laughs> they're true, Irish. True, true, yeah. true, true. They're Catholic. They're Catholic. And they're your cops, they're usually. Also. Yeah, mostly. Uh, so, but for somehow, some reason, oh, well, yeah, there's a, they end up with like uh Shannon, there's a, there's a little detour. Oh, no, 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 sorry. First of all, there's, 
the uh, community. A, a, yeah, a declaration of emergency is yes. declared yeah. because there's a serial killer that nobody knows who, what's happening, running around killing people in this town. So they say, the FBI dude says, we're going to shut everything down and everybody curfew. should stay in with a curfew. Yeah. Somehow, this translates into... We're all going to bunk in the community center. Yes. Even though everybody has yes. their own house. Well, it's because they get, don't they get, Again, like, attacked right away? No locations. There's safety in numbers, Colin. <laughs> and yeah, they only have there's... one house. <laughs> <laughs> it would cost too much to heat. No, 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 no. Why are they all stay? I don't know. I didn't understand it. There's a blizzard coming because the task force, the FBI task force, can't get there yes. because they're going to get snowed in and, uh, and uh, they're at the top of the and, they're at the top of snowmonton so it has to go up <laughs> the hills they can't get to it because like the focus of the movie there it turns into like fbi guy going i'll do this bring my men in and they're like you don't know the terrain and then they're like that fence isn't there anymore <laughs> <laughs> like they fucking smile at each other. It's like Jesus fucking Christ. That, uh-huh. that part cracked me up. The is- sheriff looks at her. He's like, Marla, tell them why they're not going to come into town. <laughs> Everyone knows. <laughs> That's why it plays like it's an in joke for people who live in wherever this was shot. Right. Right. It's That's like it if you're like. from that shot in you or town and you watch this movie, it's going to have like, like extra. Ah, really? Yeah. That's what it felt like. This is like. not a real it town. Felt like it was like, I know. That's why it's no, weird. Where it was, it's where weird. it was filmed. It's just bad, right? It's just like how these people know each other. It's, 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 uh, I don't know. You just get that in a lot of movies, right? The big wig, uh, comes in and thinks, is it like, yeah, I'm taking over the jurisdiction. Yeah. There are a lot of movies are like that. A lot that. of people are like, taking over. Or the FBI guy wants to like make good on like, you know, I'm going to prove that my shit's real. Yeah. So I'm going to boss everyone around. But the specific gonna... like geographic thing, like only we would know that, you know, like, no, it's I'm gonna, just the saying, no, I'm just saying they just the use fuck. that like, like uh. you need me in this. I know I grew up in this, t- you know, yeah. this didn't have that scene. It just had a stupid little like fence thing, but. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> there should have been like, you need me, Sheriff. We used to go fishing down at Nobbler's Gob or whatever. <laughs> Gobbler's Knob. Gobbler's Knob. Gobbler's Knob. I remember we did that. It was always Nobbler's Gob. Gobbler's Gob. Gob. Gobbler's Gob. Yeah, that's what you remember about Groundhog Day. <laughs> yep. You get it mixed around. Uh, <laughs> well, while everyone is uh, sequestered in the uh, community remember. center, this is when <laughs> Shannon Elizabeth takes her the opportunity to go to the sheriff's her house. Boyfriend in the sheriff's house. Like, what the hell? It's like, well, we know that nobody's there. Fun. It's like one couple on, every year from every graduating class it? that has to have sex in the sheriff's house. It's a tradition. It's been yeah. going on for five years, and the sheriff doesn't know. <laughs> Come on. See, I think it is Travis's idea. I think they only had one house. Yeah. I, agree. No, I agree. They already used the it's kitchen, and they already used the living no, room. No, even, even the outside, because the one house, they showed the front. Another house, they showed the back. And the third house, they showed the side. So what kind of dicks, <laughs> yeah. what kind of dicks on this movie's like? So are they you brilliant? Can't, no, you can't use my house. Be like, what? Wow, you're in. <laughs> so they but break they're brilliant in. then because no, they, they, they divided that up between one house. <laughs> they did it's not. Brilliant. Like I said, the sheriff we was in the kitchen. We got to email shit. this guy and find out if this is the case. Oh, but now I, I need to know. Yeah, I know. It's like how many? Did it you, is one, one house. house. If you're listening to this, Michael Faber, Cooney, Cooney. Cooney. Yeah. Cooney, please let us know if that was one house. Your grandma's house. We please need to do. know. Because then you do have like a we're in a center of town where we got like a here's a community center across the street's a hardware store across the street from that's the sheriff's office. Everything is within like a ten yeah. foot. Like, it looks like one of those towns. Like there was a western town in somewhere around here where it's just a facade. Ghost and, town. Well, well, but it's in the middle of a city where it just oh, looks Wild like... Oh, West Town. Yeah, yeah it's yeah. Wild West Town. It looks yeah. like that. There's the facade of, like, five West stores, but inside's, like, a restaurant. Right <laughs> yeah. Here. And yeah. It's a sporting goods store. But outside, it looks like a West Town. It's yeah. like one of those. Yeah, because you do literally just see, like, the three, like... Location. Yeah, and there's never any traveling outside. shot that kind of shows the geography of it. You just kind of cut no to a cars. door that was five feet away from the last door. You yeah, yeah. yeah. He, gets in the, oh, he gets dude. in the truck and all of a sudden he's in a stairwell. We don't know where. Yeah. It's, a, it's, yeah. weird. it's very weird. Geography doesn't really matter for no. much in this movie I mean, from what so. you can gather of it. Not at all. Interior because... or exterior. Yeah. Okay, like the wife. You're upstairs, you're downstairs, suddenly you're between, you don't know how you The got sheriff's there. like, yeah. hey kid, where'd your fucking mom go? She's. He's like, I, she went to go get towels. I don't know. You know, like, so like, 
For some reason, <laughs> thank you. Holly. The mom's yeah. just like, I know what to do during an emergency. I'll just we go. need blankets. We need blankets. I don't want to <laughs> yeah. disturb anybody. Just just instead shocked. of just They're taking my shocked. family back to my house, I'm gonna go back to my house and get. The I'm gonna go back to my house. Yeah. So she goes to get blankets. Was that before Shannon Elizabeth and her boyfriend were uh, disrobing I for five so. minutes I in think the this kitchen? Before. Okay. Was it had to have been before. It had to have been so. before because. They Fuck die guys. in the house. Oh, it was oh, when they oh. left. Yeah. It was right after they left. It was yeah. right after yeah. they left. Because that's what, like, just talk about how shit's just odd about this movie. Is because, like, the wife gets some blankets. The sink she, starts leaking. like She's like, oh, the deputy guy's here. And he had just died by getting run over by Jack Frost. Well, yeah, you think it's going to be the deputy guy or whatever. But then, like, of course, there's, like, a water. Well, there's, like, a slow, like... There's water on the floor. Everything, like everything, suspenseful in this is just right because they water? treat the water like acid. Water is it water? Oh, yeah. it's it's we established that he can refreeze himself from water. Let's I think we did, I think right? Yeah, melt yeah. to refreeze himself. Yeah. Whatever. So the water is supposed to be a big thing. That way, you don't have to look at the fucking suit, and you can like <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> he can so be anywhere. She opens the cupboard, and the fucking water uh, is leaking from the sink. Then another deputy comes behind her and scares her. Because it's a horror movie. And it's a horror movie. You gotta have that. And, that's and she's scene. just like, where did you come? It's like, you fucking know where he came from. <laughs> you just... Uh. Yeah. <laughs> you were just banging on the just, window trying to there. get his attention. <laughs> it was retarded. Uh, this movie. Yeah. And the kids, uh, once they get... Well, what happens? The kids they leave. About, and yeah, Shannon Elizabeth. We didn't talk, we didn't talk the about the sauce. scene where they undress. The five-minute montage the five minute. of like... <laughs> Oh, or yeah. hand dressing, we're just peeling like, off uh, their layers uh, and layers of clothes. Oh, yeah. But they've got long underwear. Yeah. And yeah. 16 she, layers. Well, she saved herself for American Pie money, which was a smart idea. Like she gave him a taste. <laughs> no, no, no. She saved herself for a movie before that where she was a stripper. I trust as far as getting naked. I trust oh, yeah. the Sean. Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> which which movie? Uh, I forgot what it's called. I'll look it up. She really? was naked right in now. this right now. Hold on. in this R-rated <laughs> movie. Which one? Which one? We'll I say it's R-rated, but there was no, 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 no nipples. You know. No nipples. You see some no. There's side boobs. You see, some well, side you see boobs. like a kind of a side butt. You see real yeah, a little rump. It, but it's an interesting uh, scene uh, because profile. she's in a bathtub with profile. water that we eventually, of course, that can it be It gets jerked. really cold. But it's like, is that scene? So he reconstructs himself in the bathtub and her hands are stuck through him so she can't move. Yeah. And then yeah, he's, he's uh, uh, what would we say, he's her. banging her up against the wall. The sound effects. Literally. The sound effects are made to sound like he's crushing her against the wall. But it plays off, like, because of the joke afterwards that the snowman is raping He's her. raping her. Yeah. Because his carrot nose is gone. Yeah. Da, yeah. Da, da, da. yeah. Which is oh. a joke at the end of the. I did not get that. And then that. he says, like, was it good for you, too? Because. That's why I'm like wondering. Says, Christmas like, comes. Oh, like, Christmas comes once a year. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Yeah. But they played it down, right? Shame. To, to shame. Make it a little shame. less. We rapey. should shame that joke. <laughs> <laughs> Circle of shame. Yeah. Shame. That was shame. a good joke. In uh, what was it? The world is not enough. I think Doctor Christmas. Uh, Denise Richards in the James Bond movie. That was the Doctor Christmas joke. Christmas comes ah. once a year. Yeah. Bravo. Yeah, bravo to them. Okay. Wow. And I the totally boyfriend gets that. killed in the he gets shot through with a couple of icicles like in his which brain. I wish which they would have utilized beats those, afterwards. I wish they would have utilized the icicle spears more. That was pretty cool. It's something you had. Yeah. It's a cheap effect. He could have been shooting those out at the whole town. Yeah. But they're like, but then we have to have like ten people in the scene. He could be turning into a big wind monster or something, oh, right? No, just whipping dude. around like, yeah. whoo, like a big frosty snow. Like could could turned into a, a snow blizzard. That was like his only thing, and they didn't even use it. Yeah. Are we saying the suit was made out of like rubber or styrofoam or something? Like we could probably make this suit. That's I what I'm it, saying. It like this is pretty, we can make this move. It looks pretty squishy. It looks more like like a puffer coat, you know? Like, yeah. it, like it had well, some it was sort definitely of insulation. Like a puppet. Well, it had some kind, kind of, of animatronic face. Animatronic. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> Everybody. It had some kind of articulation in the eyebrows. Which is eyebrows. the hand. I was like, like it was puppetry. You, yeah, it was called the Kermit thing. It's, like, it's basically a sock puppet. It just cost maybe $50. Uh, Did you find more, out what this was? more than $50. Where can we see so Shannon and Elizabeth's boobs? Uh, on, in 13 can't. Ghosts. Isn't she the bathtub ghost in 13 Ghosts? No. 
You sure? She's the daughter. That's right. Okay. The bathtub goes to someone completely different. Right. Damn it all to hell. Damn it Sorry. All to hell. We will track this down for I you, will, ladies I and gentlemen. We are and on, it is. It's Dish Dogs. We have one of our people. Dish Dogs? Dish Dogs is what it's, it's called. Name it's, of it is. It's got, I think it's got Matthew Lillard in it. Uh, it's oh, so a, you know it's good. Oh, great. It's well, not yeah. a good movie, but it's Dish Dogs. Crazy. She's a stripper. Hmm. Yeah. Fantastic. Nice. We'll, we'll look into that. Yep. Well, Already have. I mean, I might. You can skip it. All right, so uh, the, the really? big moment. Photos look online. up the scene. Yeah, yeah. find YouTube the scene. YouTube or something. There you go. The big moment that follows uh, these two, the double murders, is that the sheriff becomes aware that there actually is a killer snowman in town. Like, he, that moment where, like, I believe it. Oh, isn't it because, what's her name, the secretary finds the scarf on the ground? Yeah, and pulls it up oh, and it yeah, comes yeah, with yeah. the... just a scarf? Yeah. So they, no, it's not just he. He goes. He goes. No, don't. It's like well, what the <laughs> why? fuck? Why? Yeah. What has led yeah. you to this? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What has led? How does he know that this is a bad move? Uh, yeah. It's insane. Who, who knows? It's insane. But once this happens, we can finally get to that. You know, the the it becomes the buddy movie where the cop partners up with the FBI guy. Right. To uh, construct an army of guys with hair dryers. Because that's how we're going to take the snowman. Now, here's my question, though, because early on, there's one of the surviving uh, cast members is a the guy who owns the hardware store. Yes. And he's running around at the beginning of the movie, going to everybody's house. He's very friendly, uh, dropping off uh, bags of salt. Yes. 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 Wait, did we mention how Shannon Elizabeth took a bath in the sheriff's house? I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't mean to go all the way back there. I was just like, that fuck is so ridiculous. ridiculous. She blow dries her hair. Then, then it's like, oh, you made a bath for me. He's like, you're in the bath. Aren't you in the bath? Did you see your boyfriend? I'm sorry. Go back to your thing. I'm sorry. Well, she it also wanted a... Uh, yep. Breaking, see, I thought, and bathing. I thought that we were That's actually maybe going to see another room of the house. I was waiting to see how they were going to do it because she said, if you want me, I want a roaring fireplace and a bottle of wine. Yeah. I'm like, we got oh, no shit. Such thing. I was gonna... like, shit, we're going to find a den or something. Nope. Like, he stays in the kitchen. Nope. She is in front of a mirror. And that's yep. all we get in, in that room. In front of a mirror that's and then it. in a bathroom. So still the same yeah. house. We're, that's what yep. we're going with, yep. Michael. One house. Feebly? Cooney. Weebly. So Weebly. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to derail <laughs> you. Hey, just Hair dryers and salt. Salt missed opportunity. Salt I totally missed so. opportunity. Yeah. Yeah, no Shotguns, salt. Fi- the shelves filled with salt. Oh, even, though, even though salt I would watch rocks. That movie. Yeah, because they put rock salt. Yeah. Rock Shotgun salt. Shells. Yes. I'd watch Jack Frost 3, rock you, salt. You know, okay. Uh, there is a re- there re- was a remake coming. No. What? no. There was a planned remake. What? Yes. From Charles Band or something? They no. just put that on a website to see if kids would talk about Probably. it, to see if it would warrant making it. This yeah. podcast and this is, is going to cause another here. Jack Frost. <laughs> it's not going to happen. This right here. Not if like, oh, look, it's, to still, do. it's still relevant. People are talking <laughs> you know, about the it. The only it's way I would see this movie is if he was just like a snowman, almost like the way Iceman was in the original X-Men comics in the 60s. There if he like, actually just looked like a snow god. Right. That'd be kind of creepy. Like just that makes more man. sense than him turning into three round balls on top of his. If that, like, if that were man. to happen, I want to see someone killed with a car scraper. It's got to be a hyphen snowman. <laughs> <laughs> uh, copyright twenty sixteen. Uh, part man, Show. part snowman. Uh, make him a cop. Oh, All cop. He's not a fucking cop. He's <laughs> a killer. Snow cop. Ice cold killer. Sorry. <laughs> so, God damn, what happened in the sheriff's office? I don't know. I remember what? them being in the sheriff's office. Oh, it blew up. No, well, yeah, but it how did it blow up? Well, well, the bug spray. Well, he starts yeah. coming in the front door, and they. And they oh yeah, because the other it. villain of this movie is water getting sprayed through cracks and doors. That's the other <laughs> like. If you want to oh, see shit. like. Oh, but yeah, but that leads to one of the, well, I dare say best scenes in the movie (laughs) where the sheriff has to, in the scene in the basement where he has to get through the, uh, all the, uh, the bug spray. Yeah. Where they're going to try and fill the room with bug bug spray with the idea that we're going to blow the building up. Sure. And he's got to get through this to a door where he's left his keys in the door because he needs (laughs) the keys to unlock the the Because the jail, the only thing covering the window is a padlock. Right. And we can't figure out how to get past that. So we need to get the keys. Because if you're an escaped prisoner, that padlock is going to shut you it's down. It's all the way over there. But the water, the water, <laughs> friends, keys. is coming in through. It's coming the, in, Colin. Should yeah. I step on the water? No. <laughs> he doesn't want to step in the water. He doesn't want to touch it. This goes on for about five minutes. Oh, it was Maybe seven. not literally. It was seven, seven minutes. minutes. 
of him know. like, I'm going to touch the keys. No, I'm not going to touch the just keys. Grab <laughs> no, no, he gonna touch the keys. Just, just grab them. He even says to himself out loud, just grab them. Just grab them. <laughs> it's a line of dialogue in the movie. <laughs> <laughs> Am I going to step in it? I'm going to I'm gonna step in it. Oh, so maybe he'll come back. Maybe I'll die. No, on his way back, he finds a prisoner who's like, don't let me die in here. The prisoner is the guy who's been delivering the rock salt. He's been delivering the salt. The hardware guy. Who originally saw... The wife gets strung up. We didn't mention the, how she mentioned earlier oh, the, yeah, uh, the, yeah. the religious wife. She always wanted she to be wanted an to angel, be a on, the angel the on the top tree. of the tree. And they really didn't deliver on nope. that. No. Like they tied no. her to a tree. And they brought not the, the star thing. down and put it on her head. Not the they same did not thing. Put, all no. they had to do was like, I mean, come on. This movie's so you fucking shove cheap. it up her ass. No, I mean, all you had to do was put on a ladder behind the tree <laughs> hanging over it. Either that or just, I mean, in the filmmaking perspective, just cut the fucking tree in half. That way it's low on the ground. Have yeah. her fucking, like, look like yep. it shoved up her. Or actually put the top through her mouth. Yep. Yeah. <sighs> Simple. We're putting it in fucking in snowman. We're putting the god near <laughs> snowman. <laughs> you gotta say it right with the hype. Snowman. Wait, is that the amazing Did snowman? You- we didn't mention that her husband was killed snowman. by an axe shoved down his throat, handle first. It was just, <laughs> at a wrong yeah. angle. <laughs> it was, well, it, it curved it down didn't his make throat. His, yeah, it didn't, like, actually make his throat, like, like bulge out or nothing. It just, whoop, it just sticks out his throat like an L shape. Like, it just went. Because right. In a horror curved, movie, when you have an axe, handle first. Yeah, that's what yeah. I was Naturally. Kill him with the handle. That's what I was expecting. Yeah, because yeah, <laughs> Snowman. Yeah. yeah, or Jack Frost. Well, Snowman Earth is <laughs> God damn it. So Jack Frost, Snowman. Like, Tell you, it's, well, it's more catchy than the Jack when Frost. Did, Snowman. So, Snowman. so help me out with this though, because there is a scene of Jack Frost possessing somebody. This is another uh, oh, hitherto yeah. undiscovered, amazing and shocking true. special this ability. This could have been used better. I mean, the human body is whatever we shed <laughs> water. So is that after the explosion? It could, it's after the it. explosion. It's after the hair dryer attack. Because yes. we did after like, he gets stuck in the furnace. Well, yeah, like how do you get out of the furnace? They, super immortal. They they whisk him downstairs uh, through force with uh, hair dryer. Oh, magical, hair not downstairs, just downstairs. <laughs> they transported, <laughs> right? They transported from one room. It was room across to the room, then whoop to the back of the basement. Like wow, yeah, crazy. in one cut. Where it's you're part, like, well, it's because they design a suit that can go downstairs. <laughs> no. <laughs> You don't, have have you don't have to. Just quick you shoot shoot it from the fucking That's waist That's what these up. guys didn't think of, even, shooting from the they waist They even up. made a comment about that when the, when the sheriff was going to push him out the window and he went upstairs in that whatever room it was, and the, the snowman was like, oh, man, those stairs were murder. Like, oh, yeah. really? They even made a comment about that. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> Wowzers. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, we're just gonna uh, jump right over. Uh, yeah, I must yeah. have been like taking little cat naps, uh, <laughs> like towards the last twenty minutes of this movie. Yeah, they trap him in the boiler, yep. uh, but then he steams out onto the window. Then they then they do the explosion. No, the explosion, no, the explosion was, first. was first. That he, was in the sheriff's office. He immediately came back. The well, he you don't remember back. the explosions because you didn't fucking see Right, yeah, they don't have the budget <laughs> yeah. to do they it. They go just... out the window, then all of a sudden they run to the community center. You're like, okay, wait a second. Uh, are we right across the street from the community center? Why did it literally take him t- 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 like five <laughs> seconds to jump out a window? And they're like, whoa, we're in the front of the thing. Whoa, orange light. Yeah, that was your explosion. What was the line when he shot it, when he shot the window? Oh my god, oh. what did he say? Oh, it was Jesus, so that's gonna like, kill me. I iced him. I, I, yeah, no. he said I iced him. I think him. he said that afterwards, but he said something just before he shot. Uh, ah, fuck. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, it yeah, was right such a good fucking line that oh Sean can't even remember. See, that's what now. you do when you kill people with one liners. But dude they don't does remember. manage to get, because he's water, he gets inside of Science Dude and comes out, and there's a couple bladder effects as he tries to, yeah. and that like a squirting uh, effect. effect. The SNL, like, like, puking. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> the, you just put a hose on the side of the face. And, and it go. didn't come out water like it should have. It came out like shaving cream. It was yeah, shaving basically. cream. Yeah. It probably was. Basically. Yeah. Because, you know, shaving cream. It was whatever that fake snow was that they were spraying around all over the place. Yeah. Yeah. Probably. Yeah. yeah. What about that stuff? But he's back. <laughs> yeah. He's not dead. And so then he ends up in the, the community sheriff. center. And then they try to, then they do the, the they force him. Into the bur- the boiler. No, they already. No, this that. is after that. This is after, after that. that. Yeah, right. They force him yeah, into the boiler. What the fuck and happens? Re- and he kills the FBI guy. <laughs> so he bites the FBI guy. guy's face. Oh, the right, because that was downstairs in the basement. Grows yes. the. Uh, that was the only cool thing. He's like, no, the no, he's well, no, that's the yeah, he does. He kills the FBI. FBI. Yeah. Then the the scientist guy says, like, what's it feel like to be you know to be whatever. Cold! 
old. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. Oh, my God. And then yeah. he possesses him. He possesses him. He goes outside. This is, this is up with the revelations from no beyond the grave. How the fuck? The sheriff and his son end up in a car. That's all I'm trying to get to. Well, like, how do they get in yeah. the car? antifreeze, right? The antifreeze. That's freeze, what we gotta get to. Which, how do we even, like, because it's like a because snowman they think it's, they gets think it's in a car. Done, yeah. How the fuck does that mean he gets into the baggie and, like, melts half his face? The kid throws or throws Sheriff the oatmeal. Just throws the bag at at, oh. the, at the snowman. Throws it at him. He just yeah, shoves he, it in his face. Yeah, because but it's, it's still handy. in the bag. How does it melt him if it's still in the bag? Uh, Damn it! Where was I in this movie? <laughs> well, we all watched it, and we're all not entirely no. clear of like what exactly. Memory's a funny thing. When does Michael Keaton show up? Yeah, the viewer is sitting there going like, I saw this movie and I know more, but maybe you don't, viewer. Maybe we are making sense of it for you. I think we are. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's but then the how kid's like, I'm dumb. I put antifreeze in your food. Like, I'm sorry, yeah. Dad. I yeah. need yeah. antifreeze. I was like, that's no. a fucking good joke. Kill you. Good boy. No, he was You're the good, good son. He was the oh, good, good son good right kid. there. Oh, thank you. Then he uh, hugged him and, and like squinted good his dog. eyes like, like the old man. There was a twinkle. Ding. I don't remember a scene where they're spraying him with antifreeze. Oh, there's a montage. It's like, you go get the antifreeze. I'm going to draw him somewhere. Yeah. And that's when they go upstairs in the miscellaneous building. So their plan, their plan, this is great because this is what you think of. I mean, you get a pickup truck and you You fill the bed. With antifreeze. Yes. You just do that. You make it a pool. An right. antifreeze pool. Because that's what you're going to do. You're going to make him take a bath in the fucking... That's How what you, you would this? do. You throw him out a window. It's like making an acid pit. Wouldn't isn't that what you, how you would do it? I, I mean, mean, come on. That's I mean, I, I don't think I would have gone out the window with him, but sure. Well, Calories I mean. here, asshole. <laughs> <laughs> how did he know... The truck was going to be there. I would have just... You know, it was just like the Lost Boys. <laughs> it was just like the Lost Boys. It was just like... And then he fights a, a slab of snow in a pool of fucking... Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, which, the, what are like, the after effects of, of stu- bathing yes, in antifreeze? That's my question. That is my question. <laughs> what ha- Are you blind for the rest of your life? What uh, happens when you do this? It doesn't he, seem safe. Does he get superpowers now? I don't want to freak oh. everybody out, but... Uh, oh. Travis routinely bathes in antifreeze. No, no. <laughs> Supposedly, that's how McDonald's and a lot of fast food restaurants <laughs> keep their lettuce fresh, is squirting antifreeze on it. Oh, oh. awesome. Sounds delicious. Yeah. Little, so little, doesn't sound that very healthy. Trace either. amounts, guys. Trace amounts. Uh, so then it's not that bad. No, it'll only, it's kill, not, you. It'll it's, only kill you over many years. Yeah. Not right now. It's only going to take 70 years. That's fine. I eat McDonald's. <laughs> That's exactly how many years I've been eating. They have the, uh, <laughs> the after they've killed Jack Frost, though his hand is still. The kid's got the hand. Oh the my hand god! Dad, you the him. arm. We forgot this mitten. So it mom wraps around goes, him, takes the hand and dumps it in the the bath, and the hand. Well, he put, she puts the whole the kid hand, in there. She puts the whole, the whole kid. kid in there. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> Fuck whatever These guys going. weren't even smart enough to do, like, And the those. hand yells. It yells. The hand is screaming <laughs> as he dies. Is screaming. Well, because I guess if any part of him is alive, I don't know, any part of him. The like soul the thing. is in the... Oh, that's what it is. Is in the yes. fucking chemical. The, yeah, the soul. Yeah. Soul is chemical. That's yep. what we've learned from this movie. Yep. Soul is chemical, people. And then... Heard it here. So he's melted, he's gone. And then they decide to put him back into... The little bottles. The little bottles. And just bury, bury it in the ground, not then, like in a case. And then or the FBI in a tarp. shows up, but to tell them it's too late. So what have yeah. we learned here? about it's the power of the community standing against uh, community. standing what? against evil. And well, they all come together, right? It's it's like, like four people came together. Well, that's all that they really. And the community had nothing to do with it. It was the four people we've been following <laughs> through the entire movie. Yeah. But specifically, the small town folks when they work together, no. instead of the no. outside influence of the FBI and I think it's all. just stay away from the sheriff's house. <laughs> that's, that's my because that's, that's where you go. Is that where more, most of the murders happened? Mm-hmm. How many a, people a whole died? Family in the sh- died in that house. Yeah. Uh, three people died. I can only think of three. Well, I mean, if you if you look at as a location, like everybody died there. The son yeah, died right, outside yeah, of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The mother and father died in it, and <laughs> Shane Elizabeth died upstairs. So and everyone the other, died and there. And the other kid died in the kitchen. Yeah, yeah. Stay yeah. Away but from if the it's two house. separate places, but wait, what happens at the end? Uh, they bury the antifreeze. We go into it, and it starts bubbling. You know what that means? He's alive. Jack, Jack Frost, Frost too. too. Luau. Was he like in Hawaii or something yeah, like that? So they go to Hawaii. Like, it's fun. literally a snowman in Hawaii. You know what? They're for like some fuck reason, around. Fuck the whole like most of our budget was all this stupid fake snow shit. Let's just like we'll give you money to make another it. one. All right, we're setting it in Hawaii. 
Well, you know we're also means. making pinata head. Right, yeah. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. Pinata Island? Yeah. Yeah. Whoa. For some reason, those ones played on, like, what was it? AMC. AMC. Yeah. Like, what the was fuck? Was it Jack Frost and Pinata Island? Like, it feels to me I like want Jack to know Frost what would show Island up. Is. No, you don't. Some... No, it's terrible. <laughs> There's two of them. Pinata Even Island better. 2. Uh, Pinata Head or whatever. Survival, <laughs> Survival <laughs> Island 2, Pinata Head. Maybe oh that's what God. it is. Trust me. Yeah, it, like, AMC, why, like why? Fear Fest. Why do you watch like, these things? Because it was, dude, there was a, no, uh, dude, this, it was preceded by out. a good movie, well, could, and then there was that one. Tell this, the title. Dude, you this turn is so it off before it's over. Okay. I was in the military. I was in a hotel in, and they in, showed this in North Carolina. I, it was on AMC's Fright Fest, right? Yeah. The uh, We saw the end of Survivor Island Pinata Head, or Survivor Island 2 Pinata Head. The fucking sergeant from across the room helped make that fucking move. I couldn't believe it. Because my sister unit was from California. I'm like, did you have anything to do? Like, what the fuck? She's like, yeah. I'm like, fucking insane. <laughs> insane. Oh, man. That's, oh, that's so just stupid. Sad. <laughs> it just proves, it's like uh, horror irony can just, it's a buck. You know, just like the Sharknado. Irony's a buck. It's just so nuts. Well, that's what I'm saying. That the it's fact so that nuts. this movie made m- enough money that the producers said we want it, we can make more money if we make a second one. At least rental. blows my mind. At least video rental. But still, well, well we're saying that the video. How many fucking ginger not... dead mans did we well, see? At least right. three. Yeah, dude, you don't for rentals. So Charles that Band needs thing. to buy the rights to Jack well, that, Frost why do you and think do Jack I Frost keep... versus Ginger Dead Man. And I mean, you can, I can see dollar signs oh, right now. Dude, like, blew my mind. Why is this not a thing? Fucking Southbound, dude. Nowadays, any shit fucking movie, as long as you can rent it out, can be fucking made. Is Southbound bad? It's, it's pretty fucking bad. horrible. It bad? Yeah. Oh, damn. And it's, it's certified. Yeah. Fresh. That's what I was wondering. I'm yeah. like, I heard people yeah. talking about yeah. this. It's movie. insanely gay. Interesting. <laughs> there's like, yeah, there's like five stories and they're all like, none of them deliver and they're very, they're really cheap and very poor. I mean, it's like, what? I don't know. Yeah. Southbound. Huh. It's insane. Right. It's very horrible. Okay. Yeah. If you disagree with us, listener, we'd love to hear from you. All you have got to do not is... Not about Southbound. Well, I don't care. Not? Write in at uh, <laughs> facebook.com slash Saturday Night Freak Show uh, or Saturday Night Freak Show at yahoo.com or on Twitter at Sat Freak Show. That's right. And we will read your comments. Tell that us you if you want us. Colin to make Jack Frost versus Ginger Dead Man. Well, I can't. It's no, legal. we're doing Snowman. Yeah, Snowman. Sorry. Snowman. The spectacular Snowman with the Not husband. the spectacular Snowman. <laughs> Stan Lee presents. It's great. <laughs> All right. Uh, so hey, maybe it. we should uh, call Igor's. That's, 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 yeah, we'll do some, read some email and then uh, or we'll get uh, to our final wrap up. So stick with us. Igor, where are you, sir? Masters! Masters, the mail! I've got the mail. So many letters. Our followers are rising. Rising. Thanks, Igor. Thank you, Igor. Appreciate it. All right, about Jack Frost, Nick Ooh. Hammond writes in and says, nice pick. There you go, Sean. Thanks, oh, it's sarcasm. He says, oh, no, no, no. He <laughs> used the sarcasm font, damn he it. He says, I Fonts love matter. this kind of schlock. The second one was even worse, uh, oh. which makes it okay in my book. I wonder how many parents put this on for their kids on accident, thinking it was the Michael Keaton one. Exactly. Yeah. All right, about our uh, last episode, we watched a movie called Cat People. Cat People. Regarding the David Bowie song in that movie, mm. the one that was used in With Birds, gasoline. But... <laughs> yep. Frank Woods uh, writes in and says, even Mickey Mantle didn't hit a home run every time. He says this <laughs> as he sits the here petting four cats. And Chris Huddleston <laughs> writes in. That's nice for Let's you, bro. Let's just keep going <laughs> on that one. He says, uh, I love practical effects and the matte paintings you mentioned in another post. This has nothing to do with cat people, but I went back and listened to your Life Force episode. Colin wow. brought up the Space Vampire episode of Buck Rogers, which got me thinking, could you imagine if Mathilda May and Aaron Gray had been a tag team of Space Vampires? That could unquestionably be the greatest movie ever. It ever. could be. We can Space dream, vampires. Chris. We can dream. <laughs> We yeah, can. but we can dream. We can dream. <laughs> oh, yeah. Somewhere there's some fan fiction. We can write it. Who knows? That'd be the next thing. 
So, one at a time, one at a time. There you go. All right, so... <laughs> Snowman. Uh, Snowman. Snowman could be happening. I don't give a fuck if we make it on iPhone, dude. We can do it. I think we Snowman? could. Snowman? Yeah, why Snowman? not? Snowman. Snowman? Snowman. Point break? It's Snowman. Point break. <laughs> this has the hyphen, so you know it's Snowman. Snowman. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Hyphens, that's what hyphens do. This is going to be great. All right, so what do we think <laughs> about this? What do we think about this movie? Uh, we're oh. going to do our wrap-ups? Wait, what is that sound? Oh you hear that sound? God. I hear something. The hour has come, sirs. Uh, thank you, Lurk. Lurk. Hi, Lurk. Thanks, Lurk. <clears throat> Lurk's our butler, for those of you who don't know. Thank, thank, thanks. Thanks. thanks uh... <laughs> yep, there you go. I, All tri- right. I tried that snowballs joke with him from the movie. <laughs> didn't Not, go well. What's the difference between the snow well in the movie? Snow <laughs> woman <laughs> and the <laughs> snowman. Yeah. Snowballs. Snowballs. <laughs> it, right. it, it, it's... Three times that joke is played. Three uh, times. Three times. The yeah. only time I wish, because like the the uh, the hardware, like hit, hit the character's dad, like right after the the kid says it, then the dad tries to say, it. I wish like she's like, I know. It would have been funny if he would have like yelled at her, like snowball. That That's what I was waiting, I was waiting for. for that. That's fucking common. That would have been funny if he just yelled it no matter what. That's what <laughs> I wanted. Snowballs. <laughs> that would have been. Great. I was so disappointed that that didn't happen. Crazy. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. It's like these guys. Miss comedy. Yeah. They don't have no comedy. Yeah. It's crazy. Yeah. So, okay. What'd you think of this movie, Travis? Oh, my God. No, no, no. Don't hold back. No, no. I'm going to say, like, ah, Jesus Christ, guys. I'm waiting for the classic line. This fucking show. Oh, I thought it was my problem with this movie. Yeah. Oh, or no, yeah. I fucking hated this movie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't even... I, I can't. I don't even regard this movie. I don't... It's not even... It's I not hate even this movie. thought of. It's not even a movie. Like... Oh Jesus! <laughs> we are we are riding the mystery science theater three thousand line here, folks. This is fucking oh, rough, dude. It is not fun. It is not fun. I swear Listen to God. To the energy of this show versus the cat people show. It's all just hate. It's all just hate. It's it's you no. Know, it's it's Inquisition. We were wondering like, Inquisition. What, what went wrong? That's what we want to know. What went wrong? Anyway, uh, no, god damn it. <laughs> Not at all. I just, I just, I've always hated these, these type of horror movies. Um, like I said, you could be fucking like airplane or attack of the killer tomato. You could be that kind of stupid or you could be serious or, but I can't, I can't just be like, Hey, what about like, I don't know. It's just who the. I can't even the words. I can't even speechless. Uh, the words, dude. A fucking killer snowman. <laughs> that's all you need to know, right there. That, that's a, that's that, a you high know concept. If you're in yeah, it's not. It's killer snowman. It's just one of those, like, dude. We just it makes you sad that people are starving. <laughs> it just makes you sad. It's just like, fuck, man. People get paid for money this was shit. spent on this. It's crazy. Like people spent money on this. Like you know. Guys, go get your neighbor some chicken soup or like <laughs> just it's like the Christmas season. Anything. Be nice to your neighbor. Oh, don't even like. No, I mean this fucking movie. It's not even funny. I mean, I wish it was funny. Like, I mean, yeah, it's funny ripping on it, but it's like I'm not fucking reviewing the night we had laughing at this. I'm reviewing the fucking stupid movie. And that's you know a good what? point. Yep. I, that that's what I'm point. saying. Yep. These, these people, you can't review the fucking fun night laughing at a stupid movie. You got to review the fucking movie. You got to pretend like you were home by yourself watching it for a movie. That's a piece of shit. (laughs) (laughs) I'm done. (laughs) Well, I do think you can have fun watching a movie. And I had... No, I didn't have fun. I'm lying. (laughs) Nope. Don't lie. Uh, You know, the... There's like a, I'm having like an evolution of pinning down exactly what my taste in crappy movies is, right? Where I think, you think you would have figured that the out? Pre- now. Yeah, but like it goes all over the map. But I'm, uh, as I watch more of them, I'm becoming mm-hmm. more aware of what I do and don't like. And it's specifically, so this is just a personal taste, but I specifically like the type of movie where, like, you can be campy in it, but for the most part, it's serious, mm-hmm. right? Like Sorceress, I think was a good example of a you movie that, like, come back to that. Well, because That's it's the most recent classic. one. That That's the I only crappy that movie he likes. 
It's the most recent. No, I mean, before that, I wouldn't no, say. No, cat people, you like it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but, I, oh, but I'd consider that a, a I good know, movie, not a crap joke. I'm joking. But the. Uh, There's a lion pterodactyl. Be nice. Yeah, be it, nice. exactly. But it thinks that it's a serious, I think for the most part, a serious fantasy film. Yeah. It has these campy moments, even at the time, you know, I mean, but then it. it and the, the reason why it's funny now is, you know, because we've had time to, you know, if things have changed yes. in the way we perceive movies. And you look back at it and you're like, that is fucking hilarious because of this line read or because of this or because of that. But it wasn't hilarious at the time. <laughs> That's the kind of stuff that <laughs> to I the producers, like. producers, like. <laughs> yeah, no, they thought they were making a real movie, which makes it even more hilarious. But yes. the people involved in this obviously thought they were making a pseudo horror comedy right or yeah, horror, think, yeah, more they, comedy right, pseudo horror were, i mean yeah they were they, leaning into jokes. the those one liners snowman. yeah like yeah, that's, that's mean, effort that's, and it's yeah. about a killer snowman so it may as well be about a wolf cop or a bar, about a shark nado you know <laughs> yeah i mean why NATO not i love a, sharks a piranha conda <laughs> so it's kind of in that league lava lantula but it, in some Thank ways you, it feels Arcee. it feels more genuine to me than a Piranaconda because yeah. like Piranaconda seems like made by some kind of, and that's not even like a corporate thing, but there's, there's better talent involved in those things that are like slumming and putting the shit together and using like bargain basement crap to shit this stuff out. Whereas this one, at least you have kind of like the, you know, like it feels like the community spirit of like, hey, let's make a movie. And so there's that. It's like, and then the, you can look at the ingenuity or lack of it and like, okay, yeah, I see that they didn't have any snow and they panicked because it says in the credits that, you know, it didn't snow when they needed it to. Yeah. They thought yep. it was going to be snow. So what are we going to do? Well, we got to fucking shoot. So we're just going to go get a bunch of cotton and put it yeah. out there. <laughs> it's like, okay, I can applaud your effort. I still think that the execution is bad, but I think it has more heart. Than a Sharknado. Yes. Does that make any sense? Yeah, I agree. yeah. Yes. So I they would rather trying. see this than Sharknado, but I wouldn't really <laughs> rather see this. <laughs> I didn't really. I mean, it's fun to talk about it, and yeah, we had fun mocking it. But there were times you just you're sitting there like, Ugh, you know, it's like is this thing over yet? You know, I mean, it's not the worst thing I've ever seen, but I wouldn't rec. I can't like in good conscience say like you know you got to put this on your Christmas time rotation. So I'd say. You can skip Jack Frost and probably just by Nick's uh, suggestion, the second one skip is even Jack worse. Frost too. Skip Jack Frost. I can't too. Even imagine. I should have brought that one. <laughs> <laughs> and the summer or the winter of sequels. Yeah. Oh, there it is. I'm really glad that Cooney made that John Cusack movie so he could pay off those credit cards for this movie. I mean, that yeah. he must oh, have identity. made money on this movie, though. That's the thing. They made a second one. He made his money <sighs> back. This was an investment. And he made money. I guess. I don't know. Yeah, we had fun watching this at par- at times. But like Travis said, you can't judge a movie based on how much fun we have making fun of it. It's not what we're doing. Um, so, yeah. It, we're serious for me. It, <laughs> <laughs> well, People listen to us <laughs> and our opinions. <laughs> you come here for, <laughs> for the facts. Uh, yeah, the difference between this movie and other campy movies that we watch, this one sucked snowballs. Oh. oh. <laughs> You're done. Mike drop. Fuck. <laughs> Sean? Um, it is a bad movie. It's a very bad movie. Like Colin said, I appreciate, um, the effort, the people, like, it is the let's make a movie, and they, they, they tried to make something. They were leaning into let's... Let's try and they, maybe too far into the comedy, but um, yeah, it's just I, it's it's a bad movie. If you, I have to say, if you haven't seen this movie, and you, <laughs> I, if you haven't seen this movie, it's You're, about a, uh, it, yeah, sorry, You're it's lucky. a it's a killer. Well, it's I don't a killer blame the guy. Everybody likes the own oh, their movie they brought. I, but, I don't no, blame no uh, it, it, but if you haven't seen it, see it. If you have seen it, there's no reason to go back to it. I'll say that it's just you really can't. Like if you've seen it once. Be done. But it's a killer snowman movie. How many movie. times have you seen this movie? 
I've this, this is the fifth time I've seen this oh. movie. <laughs> I'll say I, I think I watched it a couple times when I was younger. Like it was, was on a re- repeat a, viewing. Was this a Netflix He's and masochistic. No, <laughs> this is he like, loves it. He loves it. I can't remember where I saw it though. If we I, we had to have gone and rented this. I'm telling you, this was, yeah. this was a rental. Not, fucking, this was a rental. This the only was not way on this TV. Thing made money is a stocking stuffer or just the rentals. <laughs> I guarantee fucking tea. I worked at Hollywood Video. That's when a this great came name out. for stocking stuffer, but oh. stocking. Oh, oh copyright. 2016 Saturday Night Freak Show yeah. Stalking Stuffer You know what this is This ah. is a grandma Buying the wrong DVD For her grandkids <laughs> Oh it is My grandma would do that Oh that's yeah. a great idea no, It's pothead It's no. potheads I know what they're doing They know like Guys man We're gonna fucking Smoke this We're gonna watch This Christmas horror movie Man Oh, um, it was but, me. That was me. I'm sorry. That was, <laughs> that's what I said. When I saw this movie. That's you. Originally. Um, unfortunately, there's not enough there to warrant a revisit of this movie. So, yeah, I, I can't recommend it either. Sorry. Oh, can't do it. I'm proud of you. <laughs> I mean, you made a good point. We can't judge it on the good time we, we had. Guys, I the figured movie, this out. I was the like, movie is bad. Fucking, the movie is like bad. We cannot be reviewing these shitty movies as good. This is not. Gonna, we will be. It's bad. Sean. But aren't there some movies? No. Like Star Crash. No. It's a movie that it's, it's a bad not movie. a good movie. You watch it by yourself and tell me it's a good movie. I, wa- no. I own it. I, get, I don't care. Yeah, you watch I've it by yourself. It by myself and I you like have it. not. You lie. <laughs> <laughs> You're a liar. Yes. It's absolutely <laughs> true. Standing uh, by it. Own it. Put my money there. So, yeah. So, sometimes you that's can the watch one a movie, movie that's bad and go like, I know this is terrible, but somehow I, I like, actually am enjoying yeah. this experience. Yeah. Yeah. But, like, I would say my one bad movie is like, okay, Forbidden Zone. That's a bad fucking movie. I don't well, like it. Well, yeah, it's a bad fucking movie. Come it's on. It's badly made. It's a bad, yeah, yeah okay, badly yeah. acted, badly made, yeah. badly whatever. It's just got but some fa- songs by Danny Elfman. But it's fascinating to watch for some reason. It's just like, ah. It's weird. It's, it's weird. But it's a bad, it's, it's, so the, weird. it's the worst bad movie. <laughs> Maybe that or Ninja 3, I guess. When it comes oh, to my Ninja bad 3. movie, my favorite bad movies. <laughs> uh, excuse me. <sighs> but there you go. It's hilarious. the same kind of thing. So. Kind of. Yeah. There it is. But I don't like, I don't like defend mine as much. <laughs> like, defend it. <laughs> I'm like, it's dark. Like, ah. Thunderdome. Like, if, if something's bad, I'll be like, it's fucking bad. Arena. <laughs> cool world. So, next hey, week. Oh! Yeah. <laughs> crazy. Yeah. Oh. Bring a fist bump. Oh. Crazy. Yeah. 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 You guys came fist bump on time. <laughs> no, yeah. we're, we're, that's the first time we've ever done that. I know. Yeah. That's how cool you guys We'll get are. it right next week. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, next week I wasn't prepared. I wasn't is going to be <laughs> Holly's pick in next week's one. movie, right? Yes. Holly, oh, my week. God. What are we going to be Christmas watching? Well, something. following Sean's suit oh of Christmas movies, we're, watch, Christmas. we're watching Santa Slay, 2005, starring Bill Goldberg. <laughs> oh, dear Lord. <laughs> Not the, oh, yes. It's going to be glorious. Tis I haven't season. seen that one either. I haven't either. I just know the <laughs> Have cover. Have you seen it? Oh, yes! I haven't seen it. <laughs> no. Oh. <laughs> Tis Jesus the season. It's Christ. a treat. Stay oh, tuned. don't we love Christmas? Right. There you I go. You All right. We already watched Silent Night. This show's becoming a farce. Else. A farce. <laughs> this awesome. must be cult movies. Not <laughs> shitty movies. Cult movies. Santa's play is a cult movie. It is Ross not is a cult. cult movie. We can prove it. I have some methodology. But we'll talk about you that next week. You have a methodology. <laughs> On the Saturday Night Freak Show. And until then, the basement is going dark. Well, this show's canceled. <laughs>